my name is Melissa and this is my new channel. Today I'm going to be making a very simple phone case craft. Um, this is the reason I am holding the camera like this so you can see what my phone case looks like right now. I just got a new phone but it is the same phone I already had. I just broke it so I have my old phone case. It's still perfectly good and fine. It's just the regular clear one which is what I get all the time actually because I like to DIY my own phone cases and I'm going to show you how to do that in a second. Um, so this is what I have. It's a little bit scratched up right now. It's just plain clear and the pop socket is very scratched up. So we're going to be also DIYing the pop socket this time which I don't normally do but I'm just going to save a few bucks right now and um, do it just by myself and then once it wears out then I will just go buy a new one but for now it'll be a fun little DIY project so come join me if you're a fellow DIYer like me and you like to save a buck then let's go do it okay this is the phone case off of my phone and it this is what I had in there last time it is actually the glitter paper from Walmart it's kind of like that foam I don't know if these actually I think they are stickers but it doesn't matter. Um, that's what I put in there and I just cut it to size and then it looks like I have this like beautiful custom glitter phone. You can, I've done stripes before and I've done glittery stickers but my favorite is just to do a simple one. And so this time I'm going to do the black one. This is actually also a paper from Walmart. It is just for crafting and it's a lot thinner. I think it's also a sticker as well but I've already cut it out to the same exact size. But that part is done simple you just set it in there and then the only other part I have to do is the pop socket so I'm just going to mod podge some black glitter on there but it's just the bigger black glitter so I think it's going to look so cute it'll just be all black and let's try I guess I'm just so extra or something because I decided I have to add more and I found these cute stickers that are like on a roll here. Uh, those I think were from Dollar Tree and I'm adding those to the background and then and to my pop socket I added this little moon and star and they're actual nail stickers that I got at a thrift store but you could find nail stickers all over the place so I am going to let this stuff dry and finish putting these on here. I'm going to have to add a little more glue because the glitter just doesn't stick well with stickers and then I'm going to have to Mod Podge the top of this tomorrow once it's dry and then I can put it on my phone. I'm so excited. I'm going to love this one. I've made like probably 10 different phone cases, maybe more. Every time we go on a vacation or it's a different holiday or season, I like to switch it up. So this is a really fun and inexpensive way to do that. Good morning, it's the next day and I wanted to show you guys how the phone case looks. This is I think the easiest way I can show you <laughs> in this mirror. How it turned out, this color definitely would have looked better with my old phone which was like the pewter color, um, but I still love it. I don't care. I got the rose gold because that's all they had left. Um, when I got my new phone, but I love how sparkly it is. I don't know how to show you guys. I guess I could show it off my phone. But if you try this, please leave a comment down below. Let me know how it turns out. There's so many different color options. I actually could probably pull out some of my old phone cases and show you how they worked out and the different colors that I've done in the past. Um, also, I got a really cool pop socket before on Etsy that was made of real stone and it was so beautiful and sparkly. It was like, an agate or I think maybe amethyst or something but I know you can find a lot of really cool things on Etsy as well if you want unique stuff and you don't want to make it yourself and someday maybe I will try making stuff and selling it I'm going to be opening a store at some point 
but I'm not ready for that yet. I've got a lot of stuff going on. So hope everyone has a good day. Hope you like my new case and pop sockets and have a happy Monday.